Many buildings are damaged in four counties. One tornado tore through Nashville and caused extensive damage to downtown and surrounding suburbs, leaving thousands of residents without power and hundreds homeless. The vibrant city is a four and a half hour jaunt from Indianapolis and a popular road trip destination for Hoosiers. The National Weather Service released a preliminary map of the tornado path that shows an east to west trout that hit Germantown, East Nashville and Donaldson before moving out of the city. The charming historic neighborhood just north of downtown is known for its restored Victorian home, S and culinary hot spots. The area was one of the hardest hit neighborhoods, with the storm gutting many homes, restaurants and bars. Aftermath photos show uprooted trees, crushed vehicles and downed power lines. The charming historic neighborhood just north of downtown is known for its restored Victorian homes, and culinary hot spots. The area was one of the hardest, hit neighborhoods with the storm gutting many homes, restaurants, aftermath, aftermath photos show uprooted trees, crushed vehicles and downed power lines. Social media posts detail extensive damage to many businesses such as Jack Brown's, Geist Bar, Restaurant and Christine Cookie Company. The quirky area with a mix of residential and lots of local restaurants, bars and shops, sustained T, chemo's damage in five points, which is packed with businesses. Photos from the area show some buildings are completely flattened, including the favorite haunts of many residents. Owners of the basement east, located in five points reported that staff were safe but said their building has been destroyed. The tornado seems to have cut a path along East Nashville's woodland and main treats, which run parallel to one another and are home to local music venue Basement East, Dessert Bar The Ada Parlor, and popular sports bar Beyond the Edge, all of which sustained damage. Here is a list, so far, of the restaurants and bars that were hit by the tornado. According to local reports and Nashville residents, including Twitter users Mentelect Brandon and Hayne Morris, 